so far it's been going a little out. <laughs> so first of all makeup wise i try to do this hack because it's been a while since i've done freckles and it works but i next time i just need to do it differently because this is a little too much and i couldn't take it off so i was like i'm not about to be late over these so it is what it is but um also i want to try this like strawberry matcha thing but the thing is i left my matcha powder at work so i decided to just do my strawberries and the milk at home and use a like my neutral bullet oh my god i literally spilled it everywhere thankfully i still had some left and i was able to pour it in my cup and it's fine you know I'm, i'll put ice and my matcha over here but i made a mess a mess i was like diosito diosito come on but you know what no vamos a dejar que cosas negativas take over today today is a amazing day I don't want to say too many details, but basically today I'm going to submit something and hopefully I get good news. So we'll see later on the week or so. But uh, I feel like it's been a while since we like, you know, chatted and catched up and so on. Um, I am still driving my roly poly. I love her so much, but she has been giving me issues. I don't even remember the last time that I vlogged previously to me starting again. But back in April, I remember I did vlog, but I'm not sure if I actually posted it. But back in April, in my brother's birthday, I went to go pick up our dinner. And on my way home, my car started overheating and this like green liquid was coming out of my car. Remember that time? Yeah, that was horrible. Thank God it was during the weekend time. My dad was able to help me. And then, a couple months ago, my actually a couple of weeks ago, something very similar to that happened to me and I had stayed overtime at work it was a Thursday and I got out of because every single time I get off of work I always check my car I made it a habit because I'm like I'm traumatized my car has me traumatized so before I drive it I always like just check the tires make sure that you know they're Gucci and I just hope to God that like you know there's nothing dripping or anything like that and I don't even use my AC so there's not really much for my car to drip but that day I remember seeing that there was something leaking out of my car and I backed out and I saw, you know, yeah, for sure it's coming out of my car. And I was just like, oh my God, what am I gonna do? My parents came all the way to my job to try to see like what's going on. My dad said, I can't help right now. Like it's, and it was dark too. Like the, the garage uh, lights dimmed really low. So it's like we can see really much. I had to end up calling a tow truck and thankfully when i went out of the garage like not with my car yet i was talking to my dad trying to figure out the whole truck the tow truck situation because they told me that they wouldn't be able to go into the parking garage because it's underground because i guess like the truck is too big and it wouldn't fit in there so how i would have to take out my car of the garage and i was like where i work there's only street parking and most of the time it's a lot of like red zones or meter parking so thankfully a cop passed by and i was like hey this is what's happening blah 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 he helped me out and he told me you see not all cops are bad and i was like oh thank you so much um i had to spend 300 dollars on a tow truck you guys oh my god that, the tow truck costed more than the actual fixing of my car and then what had happened oh and then a couple weeks ago uh, it was during the weekend I was running my errands I went to Costco and then I went to Target and when I got back out from Target to turn on my car my car wouldn't turn on and I was like what is happening this has, this has never happened to me before and next thing you know it was my battery I had to replace my battery so there's been issues that my baby girl has been having but I need her to last a little bit longer because your girl got other things she got to do before buying a car so I'm really hoping que me dure un poquito más but other than that, I've just been chilling, literally just chilling, enjoying my own peace. That's literally what I have been doing. We just got off of Target, and if you know this, I came with my mom. So i sometimes prank her because a while back ago one time when she was playing out of the parking lot she locked the door on me and she just kept going i'll do that to her right now just 
got off of work and it's Friday. And I thought, hmm, what about if I go, and it was payday, if I just go ahead and go grocery shopping today. That way I don't feel like, I'm still debating if I wanna go to the gym or not because I did not go Thursday and Friday. And I'm thinking about going tomorrow, but I'm not sure. But the point is, usually I do go on Saturday, and then I go to grocery shopping after, and then that consumes a lot of like my day. So I thought, why not just get it over with today? So let's go grocery shopping. First stop, Costco. I found the Fairlight protein, and now I'm gonna get some oatmeal. Guacamole, Ronaldo's chicken, some mushrooms, some bell peppers. Some broccoli, some strawberries. Albertson's time. So I'm gonna do Alfredo sauce, but I think I'm gonna do the roasted garlic one. Sounds better, and I believe it's 60 calories. There you go. And of course, I'm gonna do protein pasta. I've been using a lot of the penne one, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and do regular spaghetti for this one. I don't think I have enough parm, so I'm gonna get some. I'm also gonna go ahead and grab this turkey right here. Normally it's $5.99, but it's on sale for $3.99. And the protein on this is six grams which is good because this is turkey bacon your standard whoa <laughs> your standard uh turkey bacon like this one for example on the protein it's only two grams so I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this out now here is what lunch is gonna be this is some alfredo pasta with shredded chicken some turkey bacon mushrooms broccoli and some dairy-free parmesan cheese i believe that is everything that is in here and that is 548 calories now for dinner dinner is basically incomplete um, i'll show you but for dinner it should be 490 calories now basically what this is is we're gonna have lettuce tacos but i have my carbs here too to fill me up and i'm gonna get those like we already have them but they're like the very fluffy lettuce so that that can be like my tortilla and then i have my ground turkey i got some fajitas and then i got my chipotle sauce with cilantro and then um, i'm gonna have avocado guacamole and then uh, yeah i'm gonna top it off with this and that equals a dinner it is midnight i'm gonna go to bed now and I'm gonna call it a night. Tomorrow, I'm gonna be taking myself out on a date and I'm gonna vlog the whole thing, so that's gonna be a whole separate video. So stay tuned for that, I'm excited. Pero Kira, Mr. Ronaldo, a Mimi's. Say bye. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys in my next video, bye.